I am watching Upper Echelon Gamers. Gaming's Me Too is a profitable catastrophe. Yeah, well, before this fiasco happened, I had some dumb fucking whore lie and accuse me on Twitter of being a pedophile. Yeah, same sexual misconduct theme. I, I blocked the fucking bitch. I posted a video showing what really happened. How these fucking whores are predatory fucking parasites. And notice it's only the females doing this shit. No man would be so dishonorable to be a, an attention whore piece of shit. Well, girls, here's the truth of it. Stop being a self-righteous bitch. Stop being a whore. Start having some fucking respect for everybody. And maybe you'll get some fucking viewership on your, your social media accounts. Maybe you'll get a boyfriend who gives a fuck if you exist. Okay? Quit being a whore. Quit wanting all fucking attention from everybody because you're a fucking whore. Quit being a bitch. Okay? Either that or go kill yourself because nobody wants your shit. And the only people who support you, they're only doing it out of pity. They're not doing it because they like you as a person. And in less than a month from now, all these little whores who have lied, their viewer counts are going to go right back down to zero into the toilet. And then when they attempt to do this shit again, and they will... They'll be shut the fuck down instantly. Doesn't matter if they change their profile names. Their face is going to get recognized. Your voice, your face. You're going to get recognized. For the whore, piece of shit, trash, filth, scum you are. Stop now, or in six months' time of doing this shit, you're going to be committing suicide. Because nobody's going to give a fuck that you exist. Everybody's going to hate you. And every time you go into any social media, the hackers you've pissed off, and yeah, you've pissed off some hackers. With your social justice faggotry and your snowflake bitch attitudes... All the hackers are going to follow you and troll you and post to every one of your followers how much of a lying piece of shit you are. Me, all I'm going to do is wait and watch. Whether you take the advice or not. Cut the shit. Nobody cares a fucking cent. Nobody cares a bit. Nobody gives a fuck at all about your attention whoring. If you really want to get your fucking pussy fucked that much, go be a whore on the street, okay? If you really want that much fucking sexual attention and validation, go be a fucking prostitute. Get the fuck off social media. Quit fucking it over for honorable people like me and Angry Joe and the rest involved. Quit trying to dismantle and tear apart society just because you don't have a fucking itch scratched in your pussy. Yeah, fuck you, kill yourself, or straighten your fucking ass up. Those are your two options. Straighten the fuck up, or go kill yourself. I don't give a fuck which. But don't come at me again. Don't come at me again. Don't go at the people you've already gone at. Don't go at new people. Apologize for your lies. Straighten your fucking ass out. Quit being a spoiled, self-righteous, entitled bitch. Develop a proper fucking sociable attitude that's decent, acceptable, 
Stop demanding people give you money just because you're a female and you're streaming and you're sitting there doing nothing. You think you're worth something? No, you're not worth shit. You think that just because you're a female that means it's fuck? No, it doesn't mean fuck anymore. The day of chivalry and the gentleman character, that's gone. You fucking killed it. Now all you're doing is digging yourself a deeper fucking grave. With this pattern of psychology and behavior that you little fucking whores are, are using to try and get attention, this shoves people away from you. And if you weren't such a fucking whore, you wouldn't have lost your boyfriends and you wouldn't be whoring yourselves out on social media to begin with. If you were decent, respectable, decent, honorable, respectable, self-controlling individuals, if that's what you were, you wouldn't be doing this shit to begin with. You wouldn't be in this situation to be doing this shit to get attention to begin with because that's what it's all about. Your attention whoring pieces of shit. Grow the fuck up. And if you're gonna support this type of bitch behavior from these whores, fuck you, kill yourself. I don't have time to deal with your shit. I'm not gonna make time to deal with your shit. I don't give a fuck about you. I've got better shit to do than to deal with some lying whore. That's why after that Twitter shit, I posted a video showing everyone the truth. I blocked the fucking whores. I moved the fuck on. The only reason, the only reason at all that I'm saying anything about it is to add punctuation, impact, to how much of a piece of shit those whores really are. And to add that same impact to the video from Upper Echelon Gamers. Long and sweet of it is, back in the day when trolls first started happening, the general consensus was fuck with them, ignore them, rage against them, report them. Well, what did that accomplish? Because they just switched from one medium of trolling to the next. Then we got into YouTube's copyright trolls, and now these whores are trolling decent people with this bullshit lie trolling. This, ooh, I'm a million miles away from him, but he has sexually assaulted me. Boo-hoo. Are you fucking insane? Who the fuck actually believes that shit? Some dumb whore got sexually assaulted. While the guy she's a, apparently assaulted by is hundreds of miles away. How the fuck does that work out? Especially right now, where we're in the middle of a situation where there's lockdown orders in place. How the fuck does that shit work? Hmm? Explain that to me. How the fuck does that logic in your stupid mind? This is bullshit. This whole situation is bullshit. And I looked at the dates that he had on that little spreadsheet. For these whores getting their view counts to go back up. The 22nd of this very month. Of this very year. 6-22-2020. This same month. Just a few days ago. They accuse all these people. And get all this. Oh wow. Oh so bad. You got sexually assaulted. How the fuck did they get assaulted? When they're stuck in their homes being bored as fuck, dumbass little attention-seeking whores. 
Sexual misconduct? My fucking ass. Fuck you if you believe that shit. You're too stupid to be allowed to exist. Kill yourself. Seriously. You're too stupid to exist. Just fucking kill yourself. The whores lying, the bitches who believe them, just kill yourselves. I don't give a fuck about you. Nobody does. We're past politeness of trying to fix your social and psychological problems. Now we're at the point where you grow the fuck up on your own or you kill yourself. I don't give a fuck which, but make a goddamn decision now. That is the psychology of where everyone on this planet is. They no longer give a fuck about trying to help you because the problem with what's going on right now takes precedence and everything else is fuck off. I'm not going to deal with it. So grow the fuck up or kill yourselves. That is what you got to fucking do. Nobody gives a fuck, okay? I don't. Echelon Gamers don't. Angry Joe doesn't. The companies you're accusing don't. Nobody gives a fuck that you exist. The only people who are giving a fuck... They're going to go away in a month when they see that you're a lying whore. And you're just milking it for all the attention you can get because you got an itch in your pussy. Yeah, fuck you, kill yourself. Nobody has time for you. Nobody cares. You're a fucking waste of oxygen. You're a goddamn waste of an orgasm. Your daddy should have shot you against the wall. Fuck you, kill yourself. I don't care. And YouTube, if you don't like this video... Go fucking kill yourself, too. Fuck you. I'm sick of the dumb shit. Just because of political justice and activism. Fuck it all.